Hey, what's up? Mr. Parker here, do, here to do another DVD Fiends review. It's hotter than a $2 pistol. In uh, Toledo, Ohio right now, there's a heat advisory. I ran out in this stuff. I was like, Ugh. Anyways, I'm going to hop out, hop right into my review. Uh, and the movie I chose to do is a Hammer release, uh, Twins of Evil. This is from Carlton. This is a Region 2 disc. But uh, don't go forking over a crap load of money for it because Synapse Films will be releasing this along with Hands of the Ripper and Vampire Circus, which are both from Carlton too. Uh, I've seen Vampire Circus. Excellent, awesome movie. And uh, this one I just watched. This is the last of the uh, Karstein, or Karstein, or whatever you say, vampire trio. Uh, this one has uh, Peter Cushing, as you can tell. And it's pretty cool because Peter Cushing plays uh, a witch hunter, witch burner, which I've never seen him do. I've seen him do a lot of stuff, but never a witch burner. You know, and now he's up there with the likes of Herbert Loom and Vincent Price, among a whole bunch of others. And uh, he was pretty good at it. He had, you know, he has that gaunt, serious face and those intense blue eyes, it's just like, but uh, I really enjoyed it. This film, kind of strange because it's not really a witch movie. It uh, involves vampires, of course, because, you know, the Karsteins or whatever, also two other movies they were in, and Loss of the Vampire and uh, Countess Dracula or Vamp Countess Dr uh, Dracula or something like that, I don't remember. But uh, this one has uh, this weird side plot, basically, with the witches, and the main plot is about the vampires, which is the uh, Count who seduces one of uh, Cushing's nieces that comes into town, two twins, hence the title Twins of Evil. Uh, there's Frida and Maria, and Frida gets seduced and becomes a vampire. And uh, there's a whole bunch of killings going around, and uh, of course there's the guy who hates the superstitious witch burners, but believes in superstition, sort of. And that's funny thing who this is played by, no other than David Warbeck. That's right, from the beyond, uh, The Last Hunter, and Ratman. And this is way before the days of beyond him blowing zombies heads off and way before his beer gutted days in Ratman. Can we have your song? Well... Please. All right. Is it a hymn, sir? My father only allows us to sing hymns. It's a uh, kind of a hymn. Ready? So, schoolmaster, you do not believe in the devil. What's the meaning of this? I demand an explanation. Gustav, what kind of a charade is this? A victim of the vampires you scorn found this morning. This is a schoolhouse, not a burial place. You're a disgusting barbaric, all of you. Now get out! These girls are all our kin. We leave to you the training of their voices, but we teach them the path to God and the byways of the devil. No, I forbid it! Let them all see. Learn your lesson. Choir master. Uh, he's pretty young and strange to see him in a movie like this, and uh, kind of a, a bigger role in this one. But uh, like again, he, him, and Cushing are pretty much the main stars, besides the Twins of Evil and the Count. And uh, it's a pretty decent flick, uh, not too much, although you get to see some boobs, a couple of gore scenes here and there, but uh, the thing about this movie, really the best part about it is the setting and uh, the set design and the outfits and stuff like that. Uh, the ending's pretty cool, uh, of course it has like a torch scene, let's go burn them, blah 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 blah. Uh, I enjoyed it, it wasn't the greatest hammer movie I've ever seen, I, th I, I liked Vampire Circus a lot more, but I thought this one was well worth your time. And uh, I'm looking forward to the Sign Apps DVD release, and I'm pretty sure I'll buy it. Uh, the Count in the movie, the villain, he's all right. It's kind of funny because not only is this, you know, usually a movie with a witch burner is the main villain, but not necessarily so. Uh, the Count is. They're both kind of opposing opposites. We got a Satan-worshipping vampire and a, a God-loving, fearing witch burner. They both go way too far on the end, on the spectacle here. And of course, you got the voice of reason, the schoolmaster, David Warbeck. And uh, it's kind of cool with the twins here because, you know, you can. Twins are always awesome in horror movies. And they kind of do the switcheroo sometimes, Frida and Maria. Uh, so if you. Sounds like it's up your alley. Like I said, you get to see a couple tits, some gore, a lot of cool settings, you know. Peter Cushing at doing a great job. And check it out, Twins of Evil. Thank you. Bye. Child, you should not be out so late. Maria? Or is it Frida?
Your uncle will be very angry. Jail. 